I started to paint in the early 40s and continued to paint for almost 70 years. I married George Seaman in 1940 and it was he who brought me my first set of paints. George was a local boy who farmed as well as painted and decorated houses. I helped him paint houses and some of the other buildings. This may have been what sparked my interest in painting. I liked to paint what I saw. We used to travel to the mountains, especially in the Dutch Creek area, and camp at first in a tent and later in a camper that George built. Often I would sit and absorb the picture and then I would go home and paint it. I also liked to paint ditches and fence lines, things that were around me every day. I really like color. I think I had a bit of flair for color. I did try sketching, but I preferred painting because of the color. I enrolled in art classes in the Faculty of Art at the University of Alberta. A professor used to come to Vulcan, where we had classes in the basement of the Anglican Church. We took some of our classes in the mountains, where a group of us would travel and study and paint. I also went over to Nanton for some workshops. These classes were arranged by Nanton Art Society, with instructors from Calgary. I painted a lot. I know I got to a hundred and after that an awful lot more. Had at least two exhibits. One was a show of my own work at the High River Library. Another one was with a group of artists in Vulcan. I sold some. I didn't charge a lot for them. It was hard to judge what to charge. In 2001, I married Charlie Andrews. We were busy enjoying life. I didn't have as much time to paint. However, if someone showed a genuine interest, I would give my paintings away. I just didn't want them sitting in somebody's basement. Painting was really important to me. It was a release that helped pass the time, especially in 21 years I was alone after George died in 1980.